Ladies, we all know that confidence is key and nothing will make you feel more confident than a good outfit that makes you feel like a stunner, like, like a solid 10 out of 10. But where are you gonna find this magical outfit? Well, you're gonna find it here at Finery, where there is a compliment waiting on every hanger. And for all of our brides-to-be, not only can you get the dress for the big day, you can also get your bridesmaids dresses. I'm Cassidy Atchison, and we're gonna do a little shopping for this episode of Lots to Do in downtown Waterloo. down with Natalie so she can tell us a little bit more about her shop, The Finery. So Natalie, first of all, congratulations on being a woman owning her own business. I just think that's amazing. <laughs> what does your name mean? Because that's quite The Finery. Well, I just wanted something that would encompass everything that Finery has to offer. So just the finer moments of life um, with weddings and things like that. And then we have the women's clothing upstairs. So just kind of the the clothes that take you through from day to day and into the night. I just wanted something that encompassed everything that we did and I wanted it short, sweet, and simple. What made you want to get into bridal and boutique and all that good stuff? Well, I actually, I went to the University of Northern Iowa and I went to school for textile and apparel there. So at first I thought I needed to move away, do the whole big city thing, but just the older I got, the more I just wanted to be local. And so I landed on Waterloo and owning a store is just something I've always been curious about, wanted to do, and just the freedom to be an entrepreneur and own your own business is just great. It's been a really fun ride. So is is that what brought you to Waterloo is you wanted more of like the small like what do you what do you like about being in downtown Waterloo? Um, I like being in Waterloo just because there's so many different things that downtown has to offer. There's just a lot of great different unique events, a lot of different stores. It's just a great area to be in and we have an amazing building so it just kind of offers like the just what we wanted, I guess, in a downtown and a storefront. So yeah. and we like being close to the university and just, it's great, it's great. So y'all's motto, right, is that there's a compliment on every hanger? Yep, a compliment so, waiting on every hanger. Yeah, so like what, what does that mean to you then? Um, actually, like that slogan came to me, I was just with my kids and I just look at the pool with them during swim lessons or whatever and Somebody liked my outfit, and I, you know, it just makes you feel good when you get a compliment. So yeah. just, and there really is a compliment waiting on every hanger. So whether it be on your wedding day or just out and about, um, it's just there really is a compliment waiting, and it just makes you feel good when you feel good in the clothing that you have on. So, tell me more about that. About like, um, how do you feel like the connection goes between like clothing and confidence? You just, you have to feel good in what you wear. So whether it be on your wedding day, you want to feel beautiful and you want to feel confident and beautiful when you leave the house in the morning. So it's just, you really are the designer of your wardrobe and you have to feel confident about the pieces that you select to have in it mm -hmm. and just feel good about um, how you feel in it, how it fits you, how it looks, how the color is on you. So we are just so happy to be able to offer that for your big day, like your wedding day and every day. So we are just um, feel glad that we can offer that to the women of the Cedar Valley and surrounding areas. So, so what has been your favorite experience so far in owning your business? I think for me, my favorite experience has just to see the growth. So we, in addition to the women's clothing that we have upstairs, I also have a wandering fashion truck that I drive around to different events. What? Yes, yes. so. It's like a food truck, but for fashion. Yes, it is, it really is. It's just a little boutique on wheels. So just adding that mobile boutique into the mix just was great getting us out into different communities that might not otherwise be familiar with finery. So that has been a really great thing. It segued into our storefront that we have in Manchester. We have a separate storefront in Manchester for just the women's clothing portion of things and we also have online. So it's just kind of, you know, taking that little chance on a little step fan and just seeing kind of where that where that took our business. So it's been quite the ride. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs>
just love a good pun. Um, so then when somebody wanders into your store, what what are you hoping to give them? What are you hoping they experience while they're here? Yes, we just want to make for sure that they have just a nice kind of at-home experience. I want my employees and myself, when somebody walks in, I want to make sure that they feel at home, that we're going to take care of them, um, that they can feel confident about where they're spending their money and the service that they're going to get, um, and that we will be the, with them every step of the way. So. I just That's want them great. to feel good. So. That's so important, is feeling safe where you shop. So obviously you have a lovely selection and we'd love to take a look at some of your favorites. Yes, yes. Where do I even start with that? Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> So this is one you have on display right now, so I'm guessing it's one of your favorites. Yes, so tell me, tell me more about it. Yes, this is one of our boho styles by Lillian West. So just boho has become just a really popular style right now. I picture these dresses like at your outdoor settings, your barn weddings, things like that, more, or even like your more industrial type venues too. Mm -hmm. So just the pretty lace here and just like the real delicate, um, appliques are just kind of what makes these dresses kind of have that boho feel to them. Just the little daintiness of it. And this fit has been really popular as well. It just looks good on, on a wide variety of different figures, so. So what, what even goes into it when you pick a wedding dress, right? Because you've got like hundreds of pretty dresses. Yeah. So like if, if somebody walks in like, Obviously you see this one right away, but then like, where do you go from there? Yeah, exactly. So at their appointments, we just ask if they have any pictures. Every bride out there has a Pinterest board just <laughs> blowing up. So we want to see kind of what they're pinning, what they're liking, what their color selection is. The more information that they can give us about the big day, the better we can help them and tune into what it is that they're wanting to start with. So we usually start with like right around five or six gowns and then work from there, pull dresses from there because they'll sometimes they come in and think they want one style but they'll leave with the polar opposite of what they thought they wanted. So it's just, it's crazy how it works sometimes but they know when the right dress speaks to them, they know. Okay. I love this one. I like the sleeves and the buttons. So like where, what do you like about this one then? I love these, the little satin strips here. It's just very, it just takes you in right at the right spot. It just really defines your waistline. So I am loving that. I love the little illusion look to this and then the illusion sleeve. So this is just a great little A-line dress with the sleeve option there. Sleeves are really popular. I have a lot of brides coming in for that. And I just love the delicate appliques and how they carry out. And it's kind of a sparkle too. Yeah. So is this like, is this is this sheer or is this like? It's sheer, it's yeah, yeah. Yes. So the nice thing is when they do have these sheer bodices like this, mm -hmm. um, the majority of them come with a modesty panel, is what it's called. Mm -hmm. So you can show as you, you can show skin if you want, but once you get it on, it's pretty. You don't even really know that that's skin, but you can add a liner in there too mm -hmm. to give you more coverage. So if you were going to put this one in a venue at a wedding, where would it go? Yeah. I picture like a vineyard setting, like with red flowers, lots of greenery, things like that. That's kind of where I picture it. More outdoors, just a small low key wedding. That's what I picture it. Pretty. Uh, do you want to go upstairs and yeah. look at some of your like, you know, for those of us yeah. who aren't well, having a wedding? We'll turn it down a little <laughs> bit. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> So it's almost September and I know that those girls are just like chomping at the bit for the fall fashion. So can I assume that's that's what we're starting to see yes, here? Yes, yes, we are getting so many new looks in for fall. So it's really exciting every day when we get boxes of new merchandise to put out at the stores. So yes, it's very exciting time, change of season. Well, this is great for dinglings like me that can't like put together their own outfit and you guys have them all over the store. Um, so with this one, what's your favorite piece on it? My favorite piece is probably the pants. I am a sucker for a good ripped up pair of pants. So I would say the pants and I'm just loving the little paper bag oh, waistline. Oh, that's so cute, I didn't even yeah. see that. So if you're gonna wear like 
more of a, like a cropped look. You don't have to worry about like tucking in everything. It's mm -hmm. just, they're great for layering. So mm -hmm. you can see I've got this look layered here with just a basic underneath. Mm -hmm. And then we got the flannel and then the quilted shacket on the outside and then layering again there in the necklace, so. I feel like if you're gonna sell these pants, they need to come with like warning labels that people are gonna make jokes about. Yes, they will. <laughs> did you pay for the rest of the pants too? Sure did. <laughs> All right, what else you got? So I feel like with this one, we're definitely entering like October, a little spooky season, the all black outfits. Yes, for sure. You gotta love a good black dress. So mm -hmm. this one is great because it's got the smocking up here. So it's really gonna just kind of accentuate everything. And then the tears are just great and trending right now. And then flat brims are always a good add to outfits. It just kind of gives your outfit a little extra flair and just kind of pulls everything together. So flat brims and then the little midi dresses are just super popular right now. And you could also layer this with a denim jacket if you wanted. So you could dress it up, dress it down. You could really yeah. do a lot with this little number. Well, Natalie, thank you so much for having us. Thank you for showing us your, your beautiful clothes, your pretty dresses. I It was a great time. Thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs> Picking out a new outfit can truly be one of the finer things in life. <laughs> so if you are looking for that pair of jeans that fits just right, or that dress that makes you feel like the main character, or if you're looking to turn heads on your wedding day, head on down to Finery and find the clothes that fit your lifestyle because there is lots to wear and lots to do in downtown Waterloo.